Okay, hey, Spatula Games here. Thanks for watching. Uh, it's time for another Red Dead Redemption 2 video. Uh, last time we did uh, more treasure, did some bounties. Uh, this time I think I've got some strangers I need to talk to. And uh, wow, I don't know what I'm going to do after that. <clears throat> I may just start in on the uh, legendary fish. I know I definitely want to do an episode about that. Uh, so let's go talk to some strangers. Okay, so here we are in Saint Denis, and this stranger has been here for a while, and I've been avoiding it because I had other stuff I wanted to do. She's right here. Doesn't say anything. <clears throat> oh. So this is what I did the last time I played, was last night I got the fourth set of uh, taxidermist requests. And so I'm all done with that because I can't finish it till the epilogue apparently. But my money is in at the post office. Won't you support our veterans and their families? Think of what they sacrificed for This is my life. stranger mission. Excuse me, sir. Would you like bother you for a minute of your time? Yes. Yeah. Nice to see you again, sir. Did you change your mind about donating by any chance? We could really use your support to improve the lives of our veterans and their families. I never declined it. I know chicken feed, sure I can help you out. That's very kind. What is your name, sir? Arthur, Arthur Morgan. Morgan. Your donation will be acknowledged. Loot the box. On the founder's plaque when the building is completed. You have a great day, Mr. Morgan. Well, good luck to you. Seems a worthwhile cause. Thank you, Mr. Morgan. Thank you. Okay. Stranger number one. Please, find him How do you do? And also... Uh, the reason I wanted to do these is because of progress. <clears throat> right here. I only need three more. But look at this. 44.4% completion. But the story is only at 20. <laughs> uh, that's pretty good. Oh, let me look at the challenges also. Haven't robbed anybody yet. That's done. Ooh, I got to work on that one. That is an epilogue. Finishing one right there. What's my horseman? Oh, yeah, I got to trample animals. I have two of my cougars with a bow, which a bow is the preferred uh, weapon for them with improved arrows. Ah, yes. Yeah, I tried to do that one. Uh, last night, didn't get it done. I need to kill three enemies in ten seconds with throwing knives. There she is. Let women vote! It's time to let women vote! 
Madam. <clears throat> and how are you today? You, my friend. What do you think about women's suffrage? Women voting? Sure, why not? Oh, thank you, sir. You are a true progressive. Anyone dumb enough to want to vote, I say go for it. <laughs> oh, a cynic. How dull for you. I do hope you grow out of it, young man. It's so unappealing. Unappealing is what I do best. <sighs> <coughs> You're walking away from history, you fools! Women and men both deserve to decide the future. This is meant yep. to be the land of liberty? But somehow, I am not free to vote? Oh, drat. Hey, mister. Oh. Hello. Why today, isn't it? Sure. What a country. I'm working on a project. Photography. Yeah, I guess that bit. <laughs> of course. Wildlife. That's my thing. Or that's what I want to be my thing. If I have to take another picture... Of a grumpy housefrau or pompous middle-class burger, I will feed myself to the lions. Stand here. Here? Just... There. Albert Mason. Arthur Morgan. Pleasure. I'm trying to find and capture images of our great predators before our greatest predators kill them all and stick them on some clubhouse wall. Good luck with that. Yes. Not the easiest. But, well, I love a challenge. The trick is to leave a big load of meat and relax and pray they don't mistake me for lunch. Oh! Good heavens! My bag! That thing is robbing me! Oh, good heavens! Don't worry. That thing is a coyote. A sneaky one, too. Wildlife photography. <laughs> Run! <laughs> this is what I'd call a robbery gone wrong, Coyote. <laughs> oh, that's the first time I've ever been able to shoot him. <laughs> Mason's probably not going to like that. I won't tell him. Don't tell him. Don't tell him we shot the coyote with a 12 gauge. <clears throat> Does that make me the predator? <laughs> oh. Well, well. Got your bag. Oh, thank you. Thank you, sir. A bag full of meat will tend to bring out the worst in the local population. You are a gentleman. The bag also had a lot of my supplies. You've saved me days. I am can't thank you enough. I'm, I'm, thank you. Don't worry about it. I'm, uh, you take care, sir. <laughs> I ain't the one trying to get myself eaten. I realize I am a fool. <laughs> Forgive me. And thank you very much once again. Albert Mason, a wildlife photographer, has his bag stolen by a coyote while setting up his camera. The coyote which we shot. Please, if I'm to attract any wildlife, I'll need some courtesy. I'll leave you alone. Oops, tree. Which brings us to our next stranger, which couldn't get any stranger.
This was Van Horn, by the way. Van Horn Trading Post. The smell of the grease paint. Let light shine out of darkness. Mister? No. Bertram, say no. Oh, that's nice. That's very nice. Friends for life, we said. Hey and now the two of you have betrayed me at once. Do you know what betrayal means, Bertram? No. It means hurting Miss Marjorie. Miss Marjorie's oh, got issues. You liked me. I've clothed you. I fed you. Bertram does like Miss Marjorie. Yes, and Miss Marjorie likes Bertram. So why don't you go and tell me where that nasty little Magnifico has run off to so I can get on with whipping that snot nose right into shape? He <laughs> owes me. He owes us. Big time. Bertram and Marjorie. Wouldn't Bertram like a sherry? Bertram like sherry. <laughs> yes, he does. <laughs> Barkeep, sherry. Everything okay? Make it the cheapest one you have. Wrap. Imagine saving people, Girl, taking them to your breast, and metaphorically, I mean, like a mother, caring right. and raising them, and then they go and stab you in the back. Have you ever betrayed a close friend? I hope not. Well. Treachery. And these are sad, low, unlovable people. And I made them stars, dreamers, entertainers. And they... Oh, no, now family's not enough. No. Um. No, he's gone off alone. My little tiny magician has gone and stabbed his mom on the back. Oh, fuck it, he... <laughs> no, Bertram! 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 Woof, woof! Bertram! Put the nice man! Do something, you only eat him. Um, uh, e e e easy there. Uh, easy there. Sherry! My time! Easy, big guy. Uh, no fear. Strong, all right. Bad, Bertram. What are you waiting for? Uh, Slow down. Bad, Bertram. Oh. I hit all the wrong buttons. <laughs> oh, yes. Marjorie's here. No one's going to hurt you ever again. Mama, you should keep that thing in a cage. <laughs> you should think about who you're serving. Give me a beer, will you? Don't worry. We'll pay for what we broke. Come here, Bertram. Oh, no one looks after you like Mama does. No one cares for you like I do. Especially not that Magnifico. Hmm? Weird. <laughs> He's my friend. Yes, well, if he were your friend, he'd be here, wouldn't he? He wouldn't have abandoned us. Oh, you wouldn't have gotten that whoopsie, would you? Whoopsie heart. I know. <laughs> Mama's going to make it all better. I but hit him a lot. Tell me where that little worm ran off to, hmm? B Bertram promise. Yes, well, Magnifico made a promise, too, huh? He made more than a promise. He made a contract, and he broke it. So you just tell me exactly where he is, and then we will all be even. That's my boy. He's camping in the woods. Why didn't you tell me in the first place? You just apologize to these men. I'm sorry. Yeah. I'm sorry. <laughs> You gave me a whoopsie. Hey, you just stay away from that sherry now, you hear? Bertram, lack sherry. Oh, don't you get him started. <laughs> no. Thank you for all of your help, <clears throat> Mr. Stranger. If you see that slippery little fella sleeping rough out there, would you just make a little racket and then we'll come along and we'll find you? I could try. Oh, his name is Magnifico. You'll know him when you see him. Come along, Bertram. <laughs> Ooh. 
The smell of the grease paint. Two members of a traveling sideshow, Bertram and Marjorie, are found arguing about the disappearance of another member of their troupe in the Van Horn Saloon. After intervening, a fight breaks out with Bertram. I hit him a lot. Alright, where's my hat? Oh, that's amazing. If you say so. Are you, uh, are you Magnifico by any chance? I'm not going back. She's a witch. She's a witch. Who? Is that the contract on the ground? She cares about you a lot. Well, I'm the talent. It's me. It's all me. I share the money with her and, uh, you know, that thing. No, stay away. You've what? made love to her, haven't you? No, that's not She's it. a succubus. She's a succubus. <laughs> Stay away from me. <sighs> hey, partner, come back here. Oh, I was trying to whistle for my horse. It won't let me. You're starting to irritate. <laughs> what the hell are you pulling here? Oh, yeah, very clever. It's steak dinner. He's gone. <laughs> Now where you gone? Ah! Ah! Stinking pig. Shit! Magnifico! Where'd he go? Get magic out of this, partner. Come, Come back here and I'll now. shoot you. She ain't as bad as all that. Uh, where's he at? He's in a tree somewhere. Where's he at? Over here, dummy. Yeah. Yeah, I just looked there. <laughs> Magic. Magnifico! Damn it! Ah! Oh! 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 no! no! Oh! 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 You got enough for a ticket? Pa. Because the way Big Fanny tells it, you spent all of our takings on a case of the French pox. Maybe I did. So what? 
What do you need a stump of a showman for? Same bad jokes? The same cheap tricks? In a package half the size? You got Bertram! You got Dummy over there! Who is Dummy anyway? The missing link? Ha 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 ha! Shut up, you dimwit! You sold me out! You should watch your mouth. You don't need me. You're better off without me. Even you, Dummy! Go on, clear off. Aim for the top, all of you. I'm out of food and I'm out of ideas. Leave me for the bears. I won't be more than a mouthful. You robbed me. Whoa. You robbed your brother. So you are going to be pulling rabbits out of your ass until you are as old as you are tiny. Put them up there. Oh, some friends, some friends. We ain't friends. No. We're family, as much as it pains me to say it. Family? Still after everything? Well, of course, you silly little man. And him? Let him at the bar agree to help. Ah, sleeping rough don't suit me much. I uh, know. Come to Mama. Oh, I did miss you. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Now, don't Weird. you ever run off on us like that again. Back together. Back together. Well, I'm glad it all worked out. <clears throat> thanks to you. Thank him, boys. Thank you. Uh, thanks for nothing, dummy. No get in the back. We ought to give you a piece of the gate on our next show. You earned it. Huh? We'll be playing Saint Denis next. Check with the box office. Here. I'll be there. No one said anything about splitting the gate. Oh, shut up. Half man and half wit. Bye bye. What I done to deserve you too? Magnifico, the missing member of a sideshow act, uses some tricks to evade capture as he flees through the woods. So, did that count? Yes. Two more strangers required. Wow, I'm over 45 now. Sweet. And still three missions left in Chapter 2. <laughs> Let's just see if I can get it. We are at La Caye with the legendary long Nose Gar, I believe. So let's go over there. It's kind of weird how this blends into the water here. Oop, that might be too far. When you pull your fishing rod, it'll tell you it's swamp. So you know what bait to use. I struggled with this fishing early on, but I'm pretty good at it now. Uh... Special Swamp Lure. Gator. Snake. You gotta drag it in. Raise and lower the rod. You're magnificent. Yes. <gasps> See how easy that was? Oh, we're I'm keeping, keeping it. You, I'm afraid. Oh yes. Now the horse will come. Because you can't, uh, you have to carry it on the horse. It's too big. I remember when I decided to get 100%, uh, I thought the legendary fish would be the hardest, and it really wasn't.
Now, how do I get out of here? <clears throat> okay. I really need to fast travel and mail that in. Where do we want to go? <clears throat> I mean, I'm not far from Saint Denis. Uh, let's go to Rhodes. Yeah. Mister. Morning. Gentlemen. Partner. Partner. Howdy, partner. Hello again. Hello. Send mail. Just so you know, it's a few hours before the next collection. Gar can grow to four to six feet and have been seen in a bayou noir. Well, Anglers suggest using a special swamp lure, which yeah, I did. Thank you. I'll pass that on. Right on. There it is. How do you do, sir? Hello, sir. What's he looking at? Hello there. Hey. He's looking at a blank board. You remind me of a feller I used to know. It's like Pearson. <laughs> now, what do we want? Yeah. Guy's playing a mouth harp. Supposed to be a. Legendary fish. Oops. Let's see if we can get him. River. So we need special river lure. There he is. You. Yes. See how easy that was? Lake Sturgeon. Oh, Where we're keeping staying with me. Come on, horse. Hurry before the train gets here. They gotta run with this big fish. Good idea. Let's get on this track. We can do this. <laughs> Hello, gentlemen. How do you do? Hello there. Ah, oh, welcome back, sir. Send mail. All right. What would you like to send? Legendary Lake Sturgeon. All right. We'll take care of it. Two of thirteen. Bye. Uh, okay, it's right down here. Legendary fish number three. River again. Spe 
special river lure. And one trick is to not throw it out as far as you can. There it is. You're magnificent. Nice. Legendary chain pickerel. See how easy that was? Oh, we're You're keeping coming it. with me. Ah, he's small enough. You don't have to stow him. Nice. Then we can go on to the next one. Uh, which is... There's one over to Owen Gila. So I could go to Strawberry. I camp for the night. Go to Strawberry and get that one. Then there is one all the way up at Isabella. Yeah. There's a legendary bison I got. I don't know. Look around. Uh, there is also one up here. There's one here at Van Horn. There's one... Well, I don't know if I have that one on the map yet. There's one up here. There's also one out here at Sistica. 13 in total. There's supposed to be 14, but the last one you cannot get. So it's actually 13. Hello, All right, so here's our you. next... Uh... Oh, I can send mail too. That's right. Send it. What needs to go where? Legendary chain pickerel goes out. I'll take care of this real quick. And mail comes in. The lake lure, which I don't need. I think I already have it. Three of 13 caught and posted. All right. All right, so we're here easy, at easy. Owen Gila. Actually, I don't know how to say it. Owen Gila. For our next legendary fish. Some burdock root. Now, where does it show it? I guess anywhere. Well, I don't... I don't know if I want to stand here on the rock. I guess I could. So, it's a lake. We can see all the fish. Lots of big fish up here. It looks like it out there. So we need the special lake lure. There it is. Again, don't cast it as far as you can. And you got a bigger fight on your hands. Oh, oh. Is that it right there? Hmm. Here it comes. You gonna bite? Oh, 
Okay, that's kind of weird. We'll go out a little further. <clears throat> there it is. <laughs> Didn't want me cheating. And you gotta raise and lower the rod. Hold it. Oh, fight it. See it drag in. There we go. Oh, come here. Hold it. Fight it. There, come in here. There we go. Yeah. Ho oh, ho, you are one fine fish, my friend. <laughs> Look at the size of it. Bass. What are you? Oh, small mouth. Legendary smallmouth bass, twenty two pounds, six ounces. Oh, we're keeping. Would you throw that back? Would you? No way. Come here, Hoss. All right, don't. <laughs> Look at the size of that fish. What? It was this big. All right, so we need to mail it in. Hi, uh, ma'am. Go to hell. Ha, missed it. A bit of a fight over there. Anyone else want to try taking my drink? Oh, you look <laughs> thirsty. Bunch of berries in this town. Oh, there's the post office. <clears throat> hey there. Welcome. Send mail. What's going out then? Legendary smallmouth bass. Shouldn't be too long before it gets there. Right on. Four of 13. Thanks. Let's go see if we can get the one right here at Van Horn. I'm going to climb here on the rock. I think I was out there the last time I got it. Uh, do I want to try that again or just cast here? I think I'm going to cast here and see what happens. And we are on a river. So we need... The special river lure. I'm gonna I'm gonna cast out that way. Nice and slow. Is that it right there? Oh, well, you're on, my friend. <laughs> nope. Oh, nope. hold it. Fight it. Drag it. Drag it. There we go. Damn, that's you. All right. Is 
Legendary Muskie. 36 pounds, 7 ounces. Definitely a keeper. You're coming with me. <laughs> Come on, Hoss. We got to get this fish up there. Actually, I'll just run over there and mail this in real quick. Come on, pal. Ooh, can we turn around here? Yep. Careful. <clears throat> well, shit. What? Hey, mister. Hello. Hello. Oh. I'm feeling now. <laughs> hey, mister, you're back. Send mail. Okay, what you need to say? Legendary Muskie. Five of 13. This isn't some weird editing trick. I'm getting these on the first try. Well, that one was the second try, but you know what I mean. The second cast on that one, but the first try. All right, so got that one. We'll see. There we go what I'm talking about legendary fish okay so let's grab this one and we need a river lure special river lure yes We'll get this one. I can feel it. Oh, got him. I got you. I got you. Man. He's fighting. Drag it in. Up, down, up, down with the rod. Look at that! Damn, that How easy was that? You! Alright! <laughs> Legendary Steelhead Trout! 29 pounds, 8 ounces. Keeping. Come on, Hoss. We gotta load this one up. <laughs> like you could run with a fish that big. All right. So we have one, two, three, four, five. Cool. Now we need to mail this one in. Uh, nice. <laughs> okay, so we're at the post office in Van Horn to mail in the uh Hey mister, you're back. Right. What are you sending? Legendary steelhead trout. Thanks for asking. It'll be on its way soon. Six of thirteen. Almost halfway. Bye then. Let's see what it says. Yep. 
We got the chain pickerel, lake sturgeon, long nose gar, musky, smallmouth bass, steelhead trout. Some of them are not available on the map yet, so I won't be able to get them all. going to get over there without getting shot Got him. Look at you. Yes. <laughs> Legendary bullhead catfish. Six pounds, two ounces. Keep. I'm keeping you, I'm afraid. There he is. That's seven of 13. We're over halfway there. But now I got to get back. <laughs> Oops. What if I can set up camp? No. Well then. Let's see if this works. I should be back on the mainland.
Copperhead? Yup. There's the horse. We're good. Golden. Uh, now what do we want to do? So we got legendary fish over here. And which one did I want to? Uh, the bluegill is not there yet. I think that's tied to a mission. I need one from here still. Oh, I know what I wanted to do. There's a bear in the camp. Oh, he got him. Oh, you're a dumb old bunch, ain't you? <laughs> Uh-oh. I ain't afraid of no grizzly. All right, let's get the big game meat. Whoa, whoa. Come out again, buddy. Yeah. Interesting thing happened on the way to Albert Mason. <laughs> if that's coming from there, then it's a westerly, so or is it an Hello again? Hello. Oh, <laughs> hello. How are you, sir? Uh, Morgan, Mr. Morgan. I'm sorry, my my nerves. I'm not quite the outdoor adventurer I thought. This is God's own country, and I feel I'm in purgatory. I know the feeling. No, oh, I hope not. What you trying to take some pictures of, huh? Some more greedy coyotes? No. Wolves. Wolves? Now you really are trying to get yourself eaten. Oh, I hope not. I left the meat over there. Thought I'd be safe, <laughs> given the wind. Yeah, sure. If you managed to attract the world's least intelligent wolf. Well, I, I... I'll stay with you a while. If anything comes, I'll protect you as needed. You are a gentleman. Now, you don't know me very well. Well, to me, you're a gentleman. Usually, I'm worse than the wolves. You had many dealings with wolves, Mr. Morgan? Sure. But you oh, never knew. yeah. Not through lack of trying on their part. A while back, I helped a friend from getting devoured. There they are. Usually they are not great fans of man. I don't blame them. Me neither. Hey, shh, there's one. Looks like we got company. Yes, yep, yes, and they're gonna they flank us too. To the trees. Now, don't do anything. I'm going to take a few photographs. Come on. Come on. Good boys. 
hungry, boys. Come on. Stay back, stay back. Can't have a man in the frame. They think it's staged. It sort of is. Yep. Magnificent creatures. Especially when close. You provoked them, Mr. Morton. Help! They ain't provoked. It's a fool. Are you kidding? <laughs> hey, is that all of them? Am One I slug should have killed him. The door? <laughs> Come on. Snap out of it, you're safe. My whole <clears throat> entire existence flashed before my eyes. Yeah, they can be pretty aggressive. <laughs> what a way to literally a dog's dinner. Still worse things happen at sea. Do they? <laughs> Well, I imagine. Perhaps wolves do better at sea. Are they good swimmers? Well, who knows? You have saved my poor foolish skin once again. Don't mention it. Well, I can't begin to repay my debt of gratitude. But no, I am eternally in your debt. I do, Mr. Mason, I do. You take care now. And you too, sir. Hello again. Send mail. What's going out then? The legendary bullhead catfish from Sisica Penitentiary. I'll make sure it makes it to them. Seven of thirteen caught and posted. Thanks. There's a mangy dog. Come on, pal. I got. This one, this one, this one, this one, uh, this one, and this one. So I still have the one at Lake Isabella. I still have the legendary bluegill down here because it's not even on the map yet. <clears throat> and I still have this one. And I think that's all I can get until epilogue. So I think I'm going to call it quits here. We did some stranger missions. We met Albert Mason. Uh, we got some fish. So I'll see you in the next one.